From the best in food to musical arts and recreation, there's a lot visitors love about Asheville, and the bees like it too. In fact, Asheville was the first city to be proclaimed a Bee City USA, so I decided to go on a little honey expedition to sample the sweet taste of success for two local businesses, the Asheville Bee Charmer and Bee and Bramble Fine Meads in Fairview. Asheville, North Carolina is the first certified Bee City USA committed to creating friendly living and working spaces for birds, butterflies, and bees. The movement was launched in 2012 by the Buncombe County Beekeepers Association because of national concern over rapid decline in bee colonies. Honey production is especially essential to bee enthusiasts like Ivar Schloss, who uses this natural sugar to make honey wine called mead. He invited me to check out his hives and get to know his sweetie pies. Oh, watch out, honey. Sweetie pie. Good morning, bees. Really, for me, the, the beekeeping aspect is, is connecting with another creature, uh, and, and in, in fact, a very fascinating creature. It's about the middle of spring here, so the nectar flows are, are typically starting uh, at this time. Um, the tree honeys are really being stored and, and saved up, and the nectar is being collected. You can see this is capped honey here. So this is, hun this is nectar that has been dehydrated, the job of the smaller bees is to dehydrate the nectar until it's at a right moisture and then they'll go over and cap it with wax. It wasn't long before I fell in love with bees too. And actually these guys are having a little snack. Um, They're cute. Next stop, the Asheville Bee Charmer. Now that I know a little bit about the honey making process, I wanted to take a taste of honey and check out a lot more. You can do it right in here. I'm page 87 from the book Fried Green Tomatoes that I've been carrying around forever. Uh, Ruth says to Izzy Therabed, you are just nothing but an old bee charmer and it's stuck with us. And in our store, obviously, we have a lot of honey. We have locally made candles, a lot of local body care made with honey or beeswax. We have uh, pillows and t-shirts, we have some jewelries, honey dippers, we have some beautiful art from Julia Fawson and Lori Terrio, both local people, that make some beautiful and caustic art for us. We have our bee theme, and we try and really stick with the bee theme or the hexagon pattern. But all in all, we really want to get the, the issue of the plight of the bee out to people. I think that's the whole reason that we're doing this. We have uh, a really big issue with colony collapse disorder. We're losing about 40% every year and that's even with master beekeepers. I wish everybody had uh, a hive in the backyard. Kidding aside, I think it would be fantastic. Something that's already really fantastic at the Asheville Bee Charmer is their honey tasting bar. We've got a little piece of the world here. Uh, everything from local, in and around Asheville, across the country, France, Italy, Spain, Scotland, Ireland, infused, a little bit of whiskey, this is how it starts, and this is how it goes, and goes taste after delicious taste of honeys, sweet and smooth, thick and nutty, even some hot and spicy. For certain at the Bee Charmer, you'll find lots of things bee and honey, but not as yet honey wine. So to sample some mead, we headed back to Fairview. Our business is Looking Glass Creamery and we're here in beautiful Fairview just outside of Asheville and we have a great destination here where you can come and have a cheese plate, enjoy some wine and we serve local Bee and Bramble wine which is made just a few miles away from here so it's great to have that. We're hosting a tasting here today of that too. Why are we sampling mead at a cheese shop? Well I think meads and cheeses are a, are a natural fit with one another. As with cheeses you have a range from mild to sharp and the same thing with our range of meads. Bee and Bramble's fine meads echo the fruits and flowers visited by the bees who provided its source honey. He offers seven blends, including a refreshingly tart blackberry buzz and his clean and subtle traditional, simply made with honey, yeast, and water. In Asheville, you'll discover new ways to love honey and the fuzzy little females working hard to make it. For North Carolina Weekend, I'm Deborah Holt Noel. The Asheville Bee Charmer has two locations, 
707 Haywood Road in West Asheville and 38 Battery Park Avenue downtown. You can also find and order products online at AshevilleBeachArmor.com. B and Bramble Fine Meads are available at Looking Glass Creamery in Fairview and various locations throughout the state. To find out more about where to find them or to order online, visit them at bandbramble.com.